Hello and welcome! In this tutorial, we'll show you how to install USD Composer, set up the Nucleus server, and send scenes using the USD exporter in Character Creator. Let's get started. First, go to the Character Creator Omniverse website and click the free download button to find the zip file link. We'll need to install USD Composer, located on the right side of the page. Complete the short questionnaire and the download will start automatically. Once the file is downloaded, unzip it and move the extracted folder to a secure system location to prevent accidental deletion or modification. Next, run the bat file to start the installation. A command window will appear showing the installation progress. Depending on your system, this process can take anywhere from 15 to 45 minutes on the first run. During installation, the program may attempt to connect to the internet. Click Allow when prompted. After a few minutes, USD Composer will automatically launch during the file transfer process. You can start using it right away, even as the remaining components continue to install in the background. Now let's set up the Nucleus server inside USD Composer. In the Content tab, click Add New Connection, then create a new connection named Localhost. After clicking OK, a web browser window will automatically open, prompting you to log in. Enter admin for both the username and password, then click Log In. Once that's done, return to USD Composer, and you'll see the localhost folder we just created in the content browser. Finally, Open the Nucleus web UI to verify that all servers are properly connected and running. On the Character Creator side, the Omniverse connector is already installed along with Character Creator, so there's no need to install it separately through the hub. We can now open Character Creator to begin transferring our character and assets. In this example, we already have a character, some lights, and props in the scene. To initiate the transfer, go to File, Export, USD, Omniverse. Alternatively, you can also go to Plugins, Omniverse, Export USD. Once the Export USD dialog opens, you can rearrange Character Creator and USD Composer side by side for better workflow visibility. In the Export dialog, choose which elements you want to export from Character Creator. You can export all, character only, or selected only. For this demo, we'll export the entire scene. Make sure the render mode is set to RTX Path Traced. If the character has animation or a specific pose, check Include Motion. In our case, we only need to include the current pose. If no pose or motion is selected, the character will be exported in a default T pose. You can leave the rest of the settings at their default values and click Send to Server. Next, specify where the project and assets should be sent. In the Omniverse Server folder, go to the Projects directory, copy the URL of that folder, and paste it into the Export dialog in Character Creator. Then, give your project a name and click OK to start the transfer process. After the assets have been sent to USD Composer, double-click the USD file to open the scene we can see that all assets in the character have been successfully transferred. However, due to light unit conversion differences between Character Creator and USD Composer, you may need to manually adjust the light intensity. Select each light in the scene, disable, then re-enable them, and adjust the intensity as needed. With just a few simple steps, you can easily transfer your entire scene to USD Composer and further enhance your rendering workflow. That's it for today. See you in the next tutorial.